Do not spend hundreds of dollars on this. Instead, let's show you how to get and install Windows 10 or 11. And if you do want to activate it, I'll take you through the Who Keys website where I buy all of my Windows keys from. My name is Corey, and here's what you'll need. A USB with at least eight gigabytes of storage and access to a computer with internet so that we can install the installation media onto the USB. You may also want a coffee to get through this process. First step, let's install our USB. Type download Windows 10 or 11 in Google, depending on what you want to download. Now you want to click the first non-advertised link or leave a link in the video description if you're worried about any scam links or anything like that. But it's usually from the Microsoft.com website. Now when you get to this page, there's going to be a few options. Windows 11 Installation Assistant. That's the best option for installing Windows on the device you're currently using. We have a new PC, so we are going to be selecting Create Windows 11 Installation Media, which will install the installation media on our USB device. So click Download Now. At this point, again, make sure your USB device is connected to the computer and make sure there's no important files on it because it's gonna be wiped completely clean. Once the file is downloaded, run the program. Make sure you read the terms. I've already done this and then click accept. Now this section is unique to the individual so you can select your language and the addition of Windows. Obviously we're installing Windows 11 and we are going to go with English United States and click next. This is the page where it states you need at least eight gigabytes of storage for your USB. So make sure USB flash drive is selected and then click next. This will show you the list of available USB drives that you have connected to the computer. So make sure that your one is selected that you want the installation media put on and then click next. It is at this point where all of your precious baby photos have been erased forever. We did warn you before. So hopefully you listened. Let the installation do its thing. It will take a few minutes, but that is where the coffee comes in handy. Congratulations, this step is now complete. You are ready to install Windows on your brand new computer. But first, we should probably eject the uh, USB the proper way. There is one step here that I like to do first before installing our Windows, and that is to remove any extra hard drives or NVMe drives that we have installed in the system because sometimes the bootloader seems to be installed on the second drive or even some extra partitions created. So in order to install a clean install Windows, I'm going to just disconnect those for the time being. Now it's time to install your Windows. Plug in the USB flash drive in and power on the PC. Majority of the time, the PC should boot straight into the USB and take you to the installation screen. But if it does not, then restart the PC and keep mashing the delete button until you enter the BIOS. When you're in the BIOS, find the boot tab. This is where you can do a priority boot and we're going to set the UEFI to the boot option number one so that it takes priority over our drive. After that, we can go exit, save changes and exit. Now eventually you'll be prompted with the Windows setup screen. This is unique to the individual, so go ahead and select your personal preferences. I'll be selecting English Australia and then I will leave the keyboard input method the same and we'll click next. Click install now. Now, majority of you will not have a product key because we'll purchase one for dirt cheap from WhoKeys after our installation is complete. Now, we personally want a key because we want to have access to all of Windows features. So at this point, click I don't have a product key. Next, we'll select which Windows we want to install. I always recommend installing Windows 10 and Windows 11 Pro. Please remember you selected this because the Windows key we will purchase from WhoKeys will be linked to whichever Windows we select. You can buy keys for Windows 10 Pro, but they will not work for Windows 10 Home, as an example. Click Next, accept the terms, and click Next. We'll be selecting Custom. Now, for those of you who buy a PC that is secondhand, you'll probably be prompted with this screen right here instead of OneDrive. Now, you can go ahead and format all of these partitions. Also, make sure the drive is empty and then delete all of the partitions that you see on here. Now, I still have two drives on this system, but as I said before, try and unplug them if you can so that you only have one drive there to install on. So select the drive you want to install on and click Next. Now, Windows is starting its installation process. Please do not be worried if the PC restarts a few times. This is quite normal. You'll eventually be prompted with the setup sequence, and this is quite honestly unique to the individual, so go ahead and make your way through that. 
you get questions like, is this the right country or region for you? For me, yes, Australia is the right country. Is this the right keyboard layout? Yes, US is what we want. No, we want to skip a second layout. And also network questions and personal setup preferences. Congratulations, you now have Windows installed and you're free to use your computer as you like. However, it will be with limited features because we still have not activated it. Now it just so happens that we recently built this setup and this PC and we have not activated it yet. Now full transparency guys, I've been using WhoKeys for many years now on our channel. I've recommended them to friends and they're the keys that we normally get for all of our PC builds uh, that we send out to clients and things like that. They have been a channel sponsor for, I would say, oh, probably going on three years now. So I have a good relationship with them and we do have a discount code for you all, IFR25. I'll leave the links in the video description as well. Um, so any prices you see on here, you can get 25% discount on top of that. Uh, so that's a pretty good deal for our audience only. Now Windows 10 Pro without the discount is $22.54. Goes down to like $16 after the discount, but we wanna go with Windows 11 Pro, which is this one right here. Currently $29.90, that's gonna go down to like $22 or something like that. So I'm gonna add that to my shopping cart. Now for my personal PC, because it doesn't have any Office products installed, I also want to purchase that for dirt cheap. Currently 74.35 US dollars, goes down to around 55 US dollars. So our current amount, currently $104.25. So we're going to go code IFR25, that's 25% off, we'll apply that. And there you go, so it's gone down to $78.18. Let's submit the order. Plenty of payment methods. I'll probably just go through PayPal. Okay guys, so that was pretty much instant delivery. We have our keys ready to go. And guys, if there's any issues with this, they've got a 24 hour support. They've also got a email for you guys to contact. They'll take care of you guys. Now, all we have to do is we need to go to view keys and codes. Our key is down here, obviously blurred for obvious reasons, but it also gives you some activation tips on how to activate, but we're gonna show you guys how to do that anyway. So what you need to do is you need to copy your key, and then down the bottom of Windows, if you start typing activate, you can open up the activation settings. Now we currently have no key, but if we go to change product key, and we paste our new key in, and we click next, and we click activate, Windows is activated. Now we have a full proper version of Windows to use. Now, of course, if you want to install Office like I do as well, I'm not going to show you in this video how to do it, but you can follow their step-by-step -step guide because we're focusing on how to install Windows and activate it in this video. And just like that, we've fully activated your Windows computer. Now guys, once again, if you want to visit WhoKeys, I mean, you can buy pink chairs like this on screen right now, or you can visit the links in the video description and you can use our code IFR25 and save yourself 25% off Windows or any other products on the site. But we're not done yet, because if you want to know how we doubled this PC's performance by enabling a few features, then I suggest you watch this video right here.